Hi there, in this video, um, I'll be showing you how to reinstall WordPress without losing your data. It is faster and easier to start afresh. You don't need to even reinstall um, your, to delete your WordPress. All you need to do is to reinstall it and you make everything clean and you start afresh. But if you don't want to lose any data, there's a way around it. So let me show you. Go to your back end of your website. Let me go to my back end of my my website right now. You go here. I'll provide your your username or email and your password there. When you log in, it should look like this. All you need to first of all do is go to your plugin, add new. Come here, type reset. See. You see WP Reset most advanced WordPress reset tool. You down you, you install it like this. It's already on my system, that's why you see this active that screen out. You see install now, there you install after installing you see activate, then you click on it, it will activate. After the plugin, this one has been activated, you see active like this. Then number two is you download, you search for WP. Um, WP all in one migration. This all in one my my all in one WP migration like this. It's already on my system, so that is why you see this one gray out. It's active already. Then number three is we download WP migration file extension, which is not here, but I will link it down in the description below so that you can download. I will show you how the three uh, plugins will work now. So what you have to do is come to your install plugin. Like I said, you must have downloaded this. You must have installed this, install this, and uh, install this. I will show you why this is important and install this. I will show you why these four are important. Increase maximum uploading size. You can also uh, um, get that from the plugin. Just just what I mean is just increase maximum upload size like this. Come to add new. You paste it there. When you paste it there, it will bring it out by image file. This one, it's already on my system. That is why it's gray out also. So like I said, so you come to plugins, then after all this one, so you come here, you know. You usually want to reset your WordPress. Maybe it's not working very well. Maybe there's something wrong with your website that you don't want. You want to start afresh. Just click on this WP reset, the one you have installed. Click on it here. Just scroll down to see option reset pro two. Say pro two, but you don't need that. This is what you need. This one site reset. Just come here and type reset. That's all. You click on it like this then you reset your wordpress are you sure you want to reset this site clicking reset wordpress will reset your site to default values all content will be lost always create a snapshot if you want to be able to undo click cancel to abort do you understand but this is what you have to do we don't want to, we, we, we do not want to reset right now so let's click cancel because this is your site when you reset you, you will lose all your data so instead of that you first of all come to plugin You see WP in one, uh, only one WP migration. This one at my left hand side here. You come to this place, you see export, import, backup, what's new. Come to export. You come to export, you see this. Just click on that. You see, click on file. This will prepare all the files in your WordPress site. It will prepare it in a file. Everything it will prepare to be downloadable let us just wait, wait a little for it to you know, generate every data in your uh, wordpress site and right now it is done it's, it said download localhost do you understand download localhost if you are not if you are not on localhost you just sit download them i'm on localhost my site is on localhost you just click download you can follow the same process if your or your 
your website is online already. This is not online, but it's the same process. So let me let me name this one. So that I won't mistake. So I'm saving it now. It saved already. It saved already. Now click close. You can see it's there. So what you have to do right now is you come to right now you have downloaded every data in your um your WordPress. So what you want to do now is going to plug in again. Stop plugging. What you want to do is you want to reset our WordPress to be afresh. It will be completely new, nothing will be there. Just click on open WP reset tools. Like I said, just scroll down to site reset. Type reset here. Reset site. It's warning you if you don't have backup, don't reset because this process is not reversible. Then, since we have backed up our, our WordPress, we can reset this. So, let's wait a little for it to reset. Soon. So this site has been successfully reset to default setting. Do you understand? Right now, it will be blank. There's nothing in your site. It will be blank if you check it. If you check it, it will be blank. There won't be anything there. It will be blank like this. Nothing. It will be blank. So what we have to do right now, we want to restore what we have backed up. So first of all, come to your plugin, click on it. You see, because the moment you reset your website, every of your plugin will be deactivated. So let us activate the one we need. We need this. We need this. We need this. Oh, basically, those are the one we need right now. Let us activate them all together. Activate. Just activate the one I tick here. Okay, the three has been activated. The reason for this is. The maximum upload is 40 megabytes, and what we want to upload is around uh, 99 something megabytes, it's above 40. So that's the reason we install this one to help us increase it. So just go to settings from here. You can see it says it's 40 MB. Just come here, increase it to maybe 256. Save changes. Okay, that is saved. Then you now come to, after that is saved, come to WP only one of people migration come to import. Okay, click on import, click on file, then look for the file that we backed up. Book Pro 2, that is the name. You just click on it, you just start. Just wait a little bit, it will restore everything in your website back to normal. If you are getting value for this video, please leave a like, share the video subscribe to the channel and uh, don't forget to turn on the notification bell so that anytime I release a small video like this, uh, you'll be the one to know. So here, just click proceed. Okay, just wait a little, then everything will be restored back to your, um, to your site. So guys, you can see your site has been imported successfully right now. Your site has been back this is back online to normal so you just click finish and that will be all for this video please don't forget to subscribe see you in the next video